Yeah, I'm chuffed for the lads. I'm chuffed for the lads. In fact, I'm chuffed for the football club to be honest, because an awful lot of hard work has gone uh, has gone into this over the last uh, the last eight, nine, ten months. So it's um, it's it's just reward. I thought we were we were okay today, but we were the only team that was possibly going to win that game, possibly going to score. Uh, we limited a championship team, a championship club, to very little, and that's what these lads can do. Um, I, I thought they were excellent, uh, each and every one of them. Was it pleasing the amount of chances we created this afternoon? Yeah, it would have been it would have been nicer if we had it maybe converted one or two. Um, I can recall Tyler in in the first half. I can recall uh, Rodgers coming in the back stick. Uh, Alfie Kilgore, Abs, and, and and Victor and Nico was, were going to uh, conjure up something at the end there as well. But we had the best chances. We were possibly the only team that uh, that were probably fully deserved of our victory. Um, but um, they showed us a lot of respect. In fairness to Rodgers, they matched us up. They went man for man all over the park. And uh, I thought our, our players responded to it, and uh, they won their individual battles. And I, I thought, I thought they were terrific because it was a dirty, dirty, scrappy. There was no flow, no rhythm to it. Um, very patchy, and, and I thought we were, we were terrific. To be fair, man to man. Looking at back at a great time to score, and Jono coming up with the goods straight after half time. We're running out of words from him. Can you help us describe him because he's a special player, isn't he? Yeah, he is. He is, and that's I knew. I knew, and uh, I, I obviously I've known Jono for a long time, and I know what uh, what what type of player he is. Um, he, he wasn't at it today. It wasn't one of his better games, but he comes up with the winning goal, and that's uh, that, that's that's the nature of the beast. But. Um, yeah, it was it was pleasing all round. Um, I I know uh, John will be the first one to, uh, to to chuck the accolades at the group, at the squad, at the team, um, because without their hard work, um, they 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 put him in. It was a great ball by Liam Sirkin as well, so uh, it was great save by Ancy near the end. So I, I did have visions. I did have visions of Gillingham coming back to haunt us and uh, Accrington coming back to haunt us. But um, look, it was it's three points. Let's not get carried away. We're uh, we're healthy. We're in a good position. Um, unfortunately, we haven't made the playoff position tonight, and unfortunately, we don't have a game next Saturday because we just want the next game. Uh, will we play again tomorrow if we could? And it's unfortunate we have to wait two weeks. Momentum is a word that obviously gets used a lot in football, but those kind of last five minutes when the lads were kind of up against it, they were throwing more and more men forward, and you know, you know, that momentum kind of helps build that confidence and that belief that we can see over the line, doesn't it? Yeah, momentum is massive. Momentum, confidence is massive, and, and that was the first thing I said when I came in uh, and took the job on. Uh, I, I want the continuity, um, and continuity breeds confidence. Now, when you get confident, you you can build momentum, and uh, the lads are building momentum. They've gone unbeaten this month, uh, which is uh, exceptional. Um, I thought Roger Moore, uh, well, they are a very, very good team and we limited them to, uh, to, to very little today. So uh, it's not just confidence and momentum. We have good players, we have quality uh, in areas. Um, we can do both sides of the game. If somebody wants to come and play football against us, we're very good at that. And if somebody wants to go toe to toe, we, we'll do that as well. It's it's uh, it's six to one really. You, you decide which way you want to play us because we'll 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 play you both ways. Um, we do have that side of our game. And uh, credit to the lads. There's not many teams can do that. But I, I'll emphasize, enjoy it. Um, I said it to the troops in the changing room. Enjoy it. Um, but don't get carried away. Back to work. Um, let's get ahead on it. Um, the unfortunate thing is we don't have a game next week, which I hope doesn't break our, our momentum and doesn't interfere with our confidence. Yeah, just looking ahead now, we've obviously got that free weekend next weekend. How does the workflow for the group change? Will you kind of have them in? Will you have a few days rest? Will they kind of well, given, I, given I've only got uh, 18, 19 uh, senior bodies uh, available to me, um, obviously with, uh, with one or two injuries, but we are a small squad. The majority of them lads have played uh, the majority of the games. So you, you can possibly see in games we do get a little bit uh, we, we do get a little bit tired at times. They need to be uh, they need to be rested. They need rest. They need uh, recuperation. Need refueling. Um, I'll give them a couple of days. I'll give them some downtime as well because they've been exceptional. Um, they've had a hard pre-season and we've had a hard is that 15, 16 game slog now. So uh, they're working exceptionally hard. And, and there's not many teams in the division that will cover the, uh, the 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 meterage that we cover in games. So um, credit to them. Uh, they're a great bunch. I've said that. I've said that for a long time. Um, and I just hope they can get away now and, and, and get their heads off football and just relax, have some family time and, and, and come down off that cloud because they're on a high in there. Well played.